Hello and welcome to my channel Shifa's Kitchen. Today I am going to show you how to make marshmallows. So let's start. For this you have 2 cups of granulated sugar, 1 cup of powdered sugar, 1 cup of cornstarch, you have 1 cup of water, then I have yellow food color, 1 fourth teaspoon, half a teaspoon of vanilla essence and half a teaspoon of pineapple essence. Then I have 1 teaspoon of salt I have 3 packets of unflavored gelatin half a cup of corn syrup also you will be needing a thermometer like this so let's start first we'll let our gelatin to bloom here I have half a cup of water to this I'll add 3 packets of unflavored gelatin here you can use 3 tablespoon of gelatin Make sure you add gelatin to the water and not water to the gelatin. You can easily get the halal gelatin in the market. Now we will let it bloom for about 10 to 15 minutes. Soon I will be uploading the recipe for macarons too. Now we will prepare the sugar syrup. To the vessel I will add half a cup of water. Then to this I will add 2 cups of granulated sugar. To this I will add half a cup of corn syrup. Then to this I will add 1 teaspoon of salt and let it boil. As you can see our sugar syrup has started boiling a bit. I will use this thermometer to measure the temperature. It should be 240 degree Fahrenheit or 115 degree Celsius. Now we will check the temperature of the syrup. As you can see it has reached 240 degree Fahrenheit switch off the flame. And now we'll make our marshmallows. You need to be quick now. As you can see our gelatin has bloomed. Now I'll whisk it for about one minute. I'm using an electric whisk. You can use stand mixer too. You need to add the sugar part by part and you need to be quick or else your sugar syrup will start getting hard. Whisk it properly. Also if you have any suggestions or requests you can comment down below. To this now, I'll add our sugar syrup. The consistency of our sugar syrup is somewhat like viscous. Now again we'll whisk it. As you can see it has changed its color and it is white. You need to whisk it for about 12 to 15 minutes. Like this. A marshmallow mixture is ready. And you can see the consistency of it. It is a bit sticky too. 
now i'll divide the marshmallow mixture into two parts now to one part i'll add vanilla essence half a teaspoon here i am making two flavored marshmallows if you want you can make one flavor for this you have to add one teaspoon of vanilla essence instead of half And the second part of the mixture, I like pineapple essence and yellow food color. Mix it. Here you can go with any color, any flavor of your choice. And it is done. Now we'll assemble it. Here I have the baking tray. I have greased it with butter. Now I pour our marshmallow mixture into the tray. Then over it, I'll pour a yellow marshmallow mixture like this. You can make strawberry flavor or berry flavor marshmallows using the particular essence and red food color. Now using a toothpick, we'll make some sort of design like this. It is not at all needed but then I sometimes like playing with my food so there it goes now over it I'll sprinkle some sugar and cornstarch like this And we'll let it set for about six hours or overnight. Here I have remaining mixture of cornstarch and powdered sugar. I'll dust my tray with it. Now after eight hours, I'll remove the marshmallows out of the tray like this it is a bit messy but then the results are really wow now over it i'll dust the mixture of corn flour and powder sugar like this Now I'll cut our marshmallows. I have greased my cutter with butter. Now we'll cut it into a square. Like this. As you can see, it is so spongy and soft. Dust it with a mixture of corn flour and sugar. Marshmallows are ready. If you like my video, please give a thumbs up, do comment and share. 
Also, if you recreate any of my recipes, don't forget to tag me on any of my social media accounts, Facebook and Instagram. Also, if you have any request, please comment down below. Here you can see the marshmallows are very soft and yummy. Subscribe to my channel, hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you.